Um, welcome to, uh, what's it called? Oh uh, yeah, Outer Worlds, that's what it's called, sorry, I was looking at my phone for a second. Um, hopefully you guys are having a good, good day. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna be playing a little bit of this, uh, just because I love this game. I really, really, it's probably, won't lie to you, one of my favorite new games that, that have come out. Like, kind of like, it's like... To me, it's up there with uh, Last Jedi, or uh, not, sorry, I didn't mean to say Last Jedi, uh, Jedi Fallen Order. Music's pretty loud, honestly. Uh, so, I'm going to play it on the story mode just because the way I'm going to do it uh, is going to be a little bit different. Instead of a speed run, it's going to be more of like a crawl. Um, and what I mean by that and is this, is that um, <clears throat> any item I pick up, anything I'm, I have, I'm going to use and try to use it to survive. So that means I'm going to be, because um, you never, like once you hit the capacity limit, yeah, you're slow, but you're never going to slow down completely. Like you'll never like be at a standstill. Um, like you'll be slow as hell, but... You shouldn't be, you know, or you shouldn't have to struggle. Like, you'll still struggle a lot in the game because you're literally having to walk everywhere. Um, but, you know, it's it's interesting. Um, like, I'm going to pick, I'm not going to try to pick up every item. But what, I'm, what I'm saying is if any corpse that I loot, I'm going to keep that stuff until it breaks. I'm not going to repair any weapons. Uh, so that means any weapons that I have that are good, you know, I may or may not have anymore. So there's that. But it, it's also like all the armor. Cause like I I did this during the uh, uh what's it called? I did it for Dying Light, where I would pick up whatever weapons I could find, any armor I could find, and I used it until it broke. And even though I'm allowed to repair it in the game, I didn't repair it. Uh, I like to add like little limitations to myself that make it harder. Now, me slowly walking from one side of the planet to the other is going to be a challenge. Because I've done, I did this before, the first time I played it. And I definitely got screwed over in the beginning and in the end. Because, like, this game is hard, no doubt. Especially on story mode, and it would probably be hard on like Supernova and all that other stuff. Which I think, uh, Supernova. If you reduce the difficulty below Supernova, you cannot re-enable it. Enemies have more health and deal more damage. You must eat, drink, sleep to survive. Companions can die permanently, which is a big issue because I don't want them to die. I, I really like the companions in this game. Not that I don't want them to die because it doesn't make it realistic. Uh, it's just they'd all be dead in like the first two seconds of the game, and then I'd be in big trouble. Um, weapons and armor work very poorly at zero durability. You can only fast travel to your ship. You can only sleep inside your ship. You can only manually save while inside your ship and auto saves are limited. Okay. It's recommended for advanced players. I would do this, but if I'm going to do the mode that I just talked about, I don't recommend it. Uh, this player's who's looking for a charge. I already do quite a bit of damage, anyways. So, yeah, sorry. <clears throat> I'll start it now. Um, cutscene may may not be off. It's been having a little bit of a sputter issue lately. Um, yeah, I'm going to have some conversation titles on. Because we're gonna need that, we're gonna need all of it. Alright, who? I will shut up so you can watch the cutscene. Hopefully, it's not out of sync. Why stay earthbound when prosperity awaits you in the stars? Come to Halcyon, the only colony on the edge of the frontier owned and operated by corporations. 
A trip of 10 short years will feel like mere minutes, thanks to the comfort and safety of your very own hibernation chamber. You'll wake up in a perfect society designed to maximize your productivity with guaranteed full employment. With only a minor term of service, you will become the master of your own destiny when you go out of this world to the Halcyon Colony. Hundreds of thousands of colonists left to drift out here forever just to keep from damaging the board's bottom line. Disgraceful. <clears throat> All right, so now we can choose who we want to be. I don't know who I want to be this game. I'm going to probably... I wish I wrote down what I did last time. Because I had a really hell of an easy time talking to everybody. And almost never getting in any uh, like unneeded fights. Uh, <clears throat> I only, only failed like twice. And that's because of the game. Well, I mean, at the end of the game, I, I got screwed over big time. But that was primarily my NPC's fault for attacking someone while they were trying to attack an enemy and then you got whatever so all right um I could just do one point in everything in strength uh it doesn't help me with carrying stuff does it it helps with Your intelligence glad I found you before the board did no oh. Critical damage, zero. This one's smarter than my navigation computer. You'll need all your wits to save your fellow colonists. Let's just what if I did hello for everybody? Oh dear. What if I did this? Your hibernation chamber. No. Okay. One. Is there one for weight though? That's what I want to know. Slippery fingers. You'll need to be careful handling those chemicals. Uh, melee damage, carrying capacity. Oh, let's do that. Integrity not likely to liquefy. Range, weapon, reload speed. Critical damage, extra damage, headshot, weak point, charm, companion, ability refresh, positive faction, reputation re. Reactions negative. If I had this one's charisma, people might actually talk to me. Yeah, I'll do this one. Uh, now I could choose. Let's do handguns. Did you to get a gunslinger? Oh, they're going to tell stories about you from here to Hephaestus. All right. My medical's pretty. Medical's low. That one's low. Um. Okay, all of them are like at 6 though, which is standard, and you can eventually get all those all the way maxed out. But for now, I think melee, I think guns and this are going to be the best. Good. I need uh, someone who yeah. can smack a little sense into this colony. Alright, so... No discernible aptitude. Colonists sound like a nice entry level carrier. Per person of your skills, expanding humanity's reach by civilizing the cosmic frontier was ambitious enough without worrying about your daily job. You have the rest of your life to decide how to be useful in Halcyon. Determination plus one. Drink effect duration plus three. Block plus one. Uh, 
Persuade, plus one. Might be helpful. Shock damage, minus three. So it would reduce the shock damage. Engineering, plus one. Dodge, plus one. End ray damage received, negative three. Food effect duration. Corrosion damage received. Inspiration, medical. I might have to do engineering. That seems probably important. Yeah, I'll just do that one. Made to listen to that dreadful music all day. Oh, I love elevator music. No, we're gonna be male. We're gonna do all right. It's face wise. Randomize that. <laughs> no, not that one. Oh, what the G? Wow. Okay. Nope. 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 No. No. Heck. Yeah, no, no, no. None of these people look. Why? Just why can't somebody look normal-ish? Uh, booby. <laughs> Alright, I'm just gonna spam it for and done. No, no, fucking god. Ooh. Jeez, they really did not do good faces for this game. And that's that's not a dig on them because you never see your character's face after that. For the most part, in cutscenes and whatnot. Alright, let's do. Green skin tone. We'll do white balls. Brow horizon, that's fine. I don't know what that stuff is. Eye size, draw vertical, whatever. Eye size. Doesn't really affect anything. I'll just put them up. Mouth size. Small. Hair. I guess the hair is fine. Hair color. I guess that's fine. Dirt, yeah, that's fine. D -d -d age. He's like a thousand years old. This is my character. Alright, we're gonna make a name. No. And Ren. We're going to call him RG for Ridge. Yes, start my game with this character. Looks to be your lucky day, my friend. Shit. 
we did it, we survived, kind of. <clears throat> ah, there you are, wondering what's going on, eh? Bit of bad news there, I'm afraid. Your colony ship was inexplicably knocked out of skip space and forced to complete its journey at sublight speeds. This means that you and every other colonist on the Hope have been in suspended animation for 70 years, give or take. Normally, <laughs> reviving someone after so long leads to some quite horrifying results. It's called explosive cell death, but it's really more of a liquefaction. Something wrong? Oh, yes, well, not to worry. I've pumped your body full of a special concoction I devised to keep you from dying so horrifically. Hopefully at all, but uh, I guess we'll see, yes? <laughs> Unfortunately, I used the last of my chemical supplies saving you. I know it's a lot to ask, but I must have your help securing more if we're to save the rest of your fellow colonists. I'd see it done myself, of course, but the board has a sizable bounty on my head. Now, my ship is inoperative, but I've managed to hire a smuggler to help you out. He'll be... Oh, I see we're in position. Good luck! <laughs> Hello, he's funny. He's like a Doc Brown slash Rick Sanchez. Oh, man. To all our lost brothers and sisters, remember the hope. Nobody remembers the hope, though. That's the thing. Nobody remembers who we are. Just they kept it hush hush. <laughs> <sighs> Yes, there it is. You are. Now, uh, where were we? Oh, yes, the smuggler. His name is Hawthorne, and he should be waiting for you at the landing site. He's to be your uh, chauffeur, so to speak. And not to worry, I'm told he's a specialist. Dashing gunslinger, one of a kind ship, that sort of thing. You'll like him, I'm sure. I've also outfitted you with a simple wireless monitor so I can track your progress. I'll check in with you as soon as you land. Good luck. I'm. Uh, all the colonists are counting on you. <clears throat> Go, baby. Looks cool. All right. It's a cool looking tree. <clears throat> they did good for themselves though when they design when they design like the planet itself. Like it's an interesting, very like. Doesn't even seem like it's a like it's, it's not a real place, but it doesn't even seem like it would like be like a normal place to ever go to. You know what I mean? But it's super interesting. <clears throat> oh. 
good lighting, whatever that thing is, it's the little rat thingy. Spread in. Oh, I see okay. <coughs> do 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 Ooh. You got you got you know, that is ripped off. Can I take his armor? Oh, I'm sneaking. Oh, am I supposed to sneak? I like how the game, like, when you're hiding in here, it, like, the, the grass goes away. So you can, like, see through it. That's a nice touch. Like, you're hidden, but they're, they don't see you. That's very interesting. Do, 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 do. Oh, you didn't see nothing. Do, 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 do. What is this? That's a light. I can't pick up. I cannot pick up the loot. But to keep sneaking, or am I good? What is this? Easy now. You've been frozen for a while. There's bound to be unforeseen side effects. Hmm. <coughs> hey, you. Come here. You've tried Hello, the best sir. Now. now try the rest. Spacer's choice. Oh, wow, that stinks. Looks like the bleeding stopped. I owe you one. Hope you don't You're mind. Goddamn me right, you owe me one. For my report, Spacer's Choice doesn't like us accepting outside help. That's why. That doesn't. Why? Better, thanks to you. I might have bled out on my own, or worse, had to go begging the boss for some Madrina time. We were out on patrol. I saw a marauder camp up in the hills. Thought I could take him. Then my gun misfired, right through my side. I mean. What are the odds of that, right? Just barely scraped by with mean? my life. Crawled in here and blocked off the exit with those canisters. Gibbering, flesh-eating, law-breaking, unemployed lunatics with guns. Some hull had grounded their spacecraft out in the open. That's a real good way to attract marauders. See those canisters by the entrance? Marauders come sniffing around in here, and I can take them all out with a single shot. Not bad, huh? True. Now, how did your gun discharge in front of you or onto your in your side? Yeah, okay. That doesn't you make look sense. Like you know your way around a gun. Got some spare ammo, not counting the bullet in my side. Here, you can have my saber too for patching me up and all. All spacer's choice weapons are now 30% less likely to malfunction. You've tried the best, now try the rest. Spacer's choice. Yeah. Yes, now that the time. I'm glad that uh, it fails 30%, or er, it won't fail me 33% of the time. Out uh, of the rest of the time. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna act like I'm, like I know where I am. Eh? Should I ask him? Nah, I'm asking I don't, like I know where I'm going. Alright, thank you. I'm gonna take your stuff, all your food and whatnot. I don't really know what this stuff is. I'm just gonna pick it up. It's blue. Anything with the blue highlight, I pick. I take. Do mine. Oh, they have to crouch in here. I guess that's smart. I guess that's fair. Realistic. Give me that. Okie dokie. And skadoosh. Can you hear me? What in the hell? This... <laughs> That's pretty funny. Ooh. Slow time. Hibernation complications detected. Tactical time dilation. Due to complications stemming from being revived after an extended hibernation, your brain processes time differently. 
Press, pressing the tactical time dilation TD, TDD button slows down the world, giving you time to think as well as take action. You have limited time in this mode, standing still drains your TTD meter very slowly, moving and attacking bring it faster. The TTD meter refreshes slowly over time. Tactical time dilation is right bumper. Hold A to continue. Beautiful. Boop. 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 This shit didn't- oh my god. I somehow shot his- everything off. I literally just- Head's gone, arms are gone, everything's gone. Interesting. I- I don't think that should have happened with this tiny pistol, but hey. What can I say except you're dead now? Uh, okay. And. Hacking and picking locks, your hacking skill. Help you get into places you're not meant to be. Mag picks are used to break open locks and bypass shunts are used to break computer encryptions. If your skill is high enough to break the security, you will see how many mag picks or shunts you need and just how long it will take. Raising your skill will lower the number of items used and speed up the process. Interesting. Good to know. Do, do. Telescoping staff. Seven is it seventy five damage per second? I'll take that. Why not? It's a new weapon I have. How do I TNL weapon safety training weapon and management? You have up to four weapons at a time by navigating the weapon, then selecting the weapon slot at the top of the menu. You this page you will also inspect your weapons, compare them, blah 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 blah. Alright, so oh I see. So I am how much? Ninety six point four percent condition. Um, I'll equip that, and I'll equip this one for third. So I have two of these, this is, I only have 110 ammo. It's not a whole lot, basics. Oh, there's a lot of stuff to read. Okay, I'm just gonna kind of, I'm just gonna kind of go through it all. You know what I mean? Just don't think I need to read everything here. I'm just gonna get it off my screen. Is that is what I like to do. I don't like to have things sitting. I like to have like my menus and stuff clear and empty. Um, it blew his brains out and all that crap. So it's good. Was that it? Was it literally just two guys? Was all he was worried about? Is this blood? No, it's water. Okay. Where did that other body go? Sorry, it's a little weird. Uh, I'm gonna take all that. Okay, what's up here? What's down there? Is there a difference? Ooh, there's more people. Okay. Boop, boop, boop. Alright. Oh, no, let me do that. Give me that. Thank you. It's kind of hard to tell where the bodies drop. Uh. Okay, look through the grass because I can't see. I don't know where the other bodies went. Let's, how, okay, oh, there's this guy, take that one, and I'll take, where did this guy die? There's two of them over here, weren't there? And two other ones ran up. One was somewhere, I'm not finding it. Okay, there's this guy, there's one more. Where the hell is his booty? I'm just an idiot. I thought that was a rock person. Alright, um, let me... 
would have changed some of the settings. Field of view is 60. Let's open that up a little bit. This thing's really cramped. There we go. That's a little better, I think. That's a little better. Okay. Hey! Get over here before you get yourself killed! No. Don't know where you what came is your from, name? Stranger, but you best keep your head down. There's marauders hereabouts, and worse, landing violators. Call on that rung leech. Landing in the veil without using an official spacer's choice landing pad. I'd slap oh, with a God, fine it's if these it people. All these marauders shambling about. Really? How is he? Uh. Shouldn't have done that. Spacer's Choice family ain't authorized to receive medical aid from off-brand physicians. We'll see him back. It doesn't matter one. though. Just I'm saving his life, people. The swift, cost-efficient fury that's made Spacer's Choice the most trusted brand in personal defense. I just, you know, need a couple of winks to catch my breath, stretch my legs, son. Seriously? But those marauders will. <sighs> You know what? You're right. It's time we cross those marauders off, find whoever owns that ship, and file a full report. Then it's gonna be fucking laminated. There you go. Here you go, Private Gimbal. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna let just let you guys do the rest of it. Job, lady, just keep doing that. Yep. Okay. There you go. We did it. Who? Oh. Canid meat. Interesting. Can I talk to this man? Yeah. Alright, well, we got the ship back, and this is the ship I'm supposed to go into, so what do I do? Do I just walk past him and get on the ship? Let me talk to him. Let me talk to her first. I'm going to talk to her first. Okay, I can't talk to you. You have unlocked by opening your map and select the destination. Uh, okay, sure. Intruders are not off. Marauder, please be informed that ignoring me is dangerous for your health. Yes, I will. Continue. I can break stuff down. Okay, interesting. Wow, that is in piss poor condition. Good. I'm not gonna. Okay, I'm not repairing anything. I'm gonna pick it up and use it until it breaks. Once it's broken, I'm not worried about it. It seems like a weird backwards thing, but like, like, I don't like just spamming one weapon the entire game. Like, I wanna, and I also wanna make it challenging. Like, that's what I do with Halo. Like, I'll use a weapon until it runs out of ammo, switch to a new weapon. Yes, yes, yes. That's all I've heard. Okay. I'm going to go upstairs one more time. Didn't realize there was an upstairs up here. All doors are on security lockdown. Nice try, Marauder. Yes, yes. I understand. It is big. You big brain to me. Good. Um, these are not locked. So thank you for that. Uh, nothing of importance. Nothing blue. Nothing not a blue highlight. Um, okay, Marauder, sorry, all these doors please are be informed. The ship has no crew for you to murder. Well, I wasn't going to in the first place, but that's fine. All right, let me through and talk to you. Vessels is a crime. 
Please submit yourself to the authority. Hello, Mom. Please be informed that I am authorized to use violent retribution against unwanted solicitors. Please return I understand. appropriated equipment and exit this vessel in an orderly fashion. Failure to do so will result in your immediate destruction. I detect an elevated heart rate, indicating dishonesty. Please prepare yourself for lethal deterrence. But I'm not average. Oh shit. You are still here. My deception protocols have failed. I have been programmed to express disappointment. I am incapable of accepting orders from anyone other than Captain Alex Hawthorne. Yeah, well, Captain's dead. I deduce from the tone of your voice that Captain Hawthorne failed to meet you at the designated location. I understand. I will require some time to process this information. Thank you for your patience and for your honesty. I am programmed yeah, to take I don't want to lie to you about it. From Captain Hawthorne. If I accept your orders, then you must be Captain Hawthorne. Do you understand? Well done, Captain Hawthorne. Yes, I, I have to be the Captain Hawthorne. Remain intact. Unfortunately, our engine is currently inoperable. Our main drive suffered a critical power failure, and we were forced to make an emergency landing. The main drive's power regulator has been irreparably damaged and must be replaced. Astutely observed. However, the probability of locating a power regulator within a worker settlement falls within acceptable parameters of certainty. High capacity power regulators are sometimes employed in the electrical networks of worker settlements. I have taken the liberty of printing you a new captain's identity cartridge. Please try not to lose it this time. This cartridge identifies you, Alex Hawthorne, as the registered proprietor and captain of the Unreliable. Do you understand? Thank you. I appreciate your cooperation. Best of luck in your search for a power regulator. Try to stay alive this time. Good to know. Alright, we leveled up. Good. Uh, anti cleo managing, blah, blah. I don't want to read that. That's too many. That's... You've leveled up. Yes, I got the notification. Um, let's see. That is pretty high. It's decently high, I guess. I'm going to do dodge. I can't. Yeah, I'll do that for now. Uh, points placed in a core skill melee will increase specialized skills one to up to rank 50. After 50, you can add points directly to specialized skills. Okay, so I'm going to try to get everything up to level 50, I believe. I think that'll make it easier, I guess. Yeah, why not? Companion ability. I don't have any companions, though, currently. Game, so you don't need to tell me about it. You give me a perk. Uh, toughness, slow the world, lone wolf. You get a new perk every even level. Unlock a new tier with every five unlocked perks. Interesting. So one, two, three, four, five. So that means I would get tier two and I'd get tier three. And that's as far as it goes. So let's do toughness. Base health, 50. Might last longer. Damage with all alone and party. Strider, uh, cheated, sprint faster, high maintenance, weapons, armor, durability loss. No. Precision. After some unsanctioned adjustments, the workbench slight alignment tool is much more accurate. Companion crit chance. Okay, interesting. I don't have any companions yet, so it's probably something for later. Uh, base armor rating. Hmm. 
Nah, we'll do this one. Okay. <clears throat> That's good. Item repair. I'm not going to repair any items. Journal. Do, do, do. Loot. Weapons and armor. Do, do, do. Do, 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 do. Do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do
And you. Alright. So. Mm. Mag 2 power. Why not? So is there a way I can upgrade the, sh the guns at least? While I have them? I see I'm not, I don't think I'm able to use that just yet, so I'm not going to. Ooh. Adreno. Alright, cool. Now that we've explored this part. Are we allowed up here? Or is there a, no, invisible wall. I mean, I guess that's fair enough. Um, where's the map? There you are. Okay. So, because we started up here, and then blah, 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 walk all the way down here to here, old wreckage, the ship, or something there. Okay, this is quite a... This is quite a... So that's epic, yeah. Cool, so there's a lot of areas I could explore, and get loot, and whatnot. So it's good. Ooh. There's a good dock thing over there. I want to go explore that. Should I just explore and go to the map? or should, I'm just going to explore the map first. Might as well and make it easier to uh, do other stuff. Ugh. Okay, excuse me. Am I dead? Okay, I killed him. That scared me. I thought I died. Yeah, that's right. Uh, what is in here? Weapon parts. Good. Alright, we'll keep going. <clears throat> Man, that looks cool. It's alright. Guess he howled at me. I don't know why he didn't attack, he just stared at me the whole time. Do that. So... Wait. Aww. I don't know if these guys were defending the uh, the lone gr grave, like, this is like, that's where his pets, or... He just died to them. I don't know. I don't really 100%. Oh, this is an old ship. Can I export? No. Invisible walls. I mean, that makes sense. So the maps seem to be more... I don't want to say they're smaller. Because they are smaller, but they're like, they're definitely more, uh... It's, it's gonna be a more I'm it, it appears it's gonna be more of like a linear type thing until I get more quests or whatever I'm just trying to explore the map now like just as a way for me to get used to the game the controls and the whatever the heck and whatnot I am running low on ammo quite a bit though
I am realizing that. Uh, how's the gun doing? So the gun dropped down quite a bit. Went well, down to 33.1%. Uh, everything else I haven't touched yet, so it's good. Uh, what's in the cave? Oh, I see. Oh, it's cool. It tells me the health that they're at. Ooh, this is a bad idea. I may have fucked up. This may be where I die. Start running. Uh, let's give it a second. Shit. cave go cool. okay weapon 26.4 percent so that, wow that went down quick and this is at 67.1 which is pristine interesting so it's not even damaged yet that's good you know. Gotta be something in this cave though. Right? <clears throat> We're right out. Interesting. No ow. Yeah, I didn't mean to hit that. Can I disarm it? No. Shit, no, can't disarm him. Okay, that's interesting. Give me this. Give me that. Give me this, that, that. So there's enemies around. Not sure I like that. I don't have enough. I have two out of five. I need three more. So, okay, well. So, where are those enemies? Are they like above me or something? I just made a loop. Yeah, I did. Right? Yeah, I did. Oh, that doesn't make sense. No, I didn't. Okay. What the hell? I made it look like I... It literally looked like I was on that... Like I went just made a giant circle. So I'll come back for that safe later. Because I don't have enough... Of those unlock thingies... That I need. So let's... 
That's why it's just a rock that made it look like it was something else. Ooh, those are big ones. Do I have any ammo? No, I don't. I don't have light ammo. I have heavy ammo. But that requires heavy and that requires light. But I got 29 bullets and that's probably... Odds are won't help too much. So I'm going to save those for now. I'll go... Uh, I can attack them. How's my armor? Forgot about that. 67% and that's at 97.4. So that's not bad. Oh, I see. It's telling me I have new armor. Ooh, whap. Boink, 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 boink. Okay, cool. Get the full. Alright. Geothermal power plant discovered. Interesante. Might as well explore it, I guess. Oh, hello, robot. You think I cannot jump over this wall? Maybe, because it doesn't seem I can jump on this rock, which I should totally human be totally human possible thing I could do. I should totally be, okay, why? Ah. You didn't think about this one though. Yeet Boom baby. There we go, baby. Alright, skills. That's going up. Defense needs to go up a little bit. Uh, defense is actually okay. Uh, stealth is low. My medical stuff is low. Let's do that. I'll apply that. Perks. I don't get another one until next time. Next level is when I get the perks. Ooh, compass. I didn't even kill that robot though. Why is that over there? Slide off shot the gun. Don't have enough. He didn't have anything on him. Uh. Okay. Was there really there was a whole gear I didn't need to jump over? That's good. Great. I love that. That's awesome. Might as well keep going around this way. I keep getting stuff, it's good. Ooh, big box. Sweet. Canids. Pneumatic whatever the heck. Interesting. Ooh, sorry, I didn't mean to dodge there. Two out of five. I still don't have enough, so I can't even get. I can't open those. I wish I had more of those, you know? Because. Pretty interesting to have that stuff. So people died here. 
But the robots are still here. So it's kind of weird, but you know, it's whatever. Alright. Now how is the suit doing? 48 26 47 Good thing this stuff seems to be going down a little bit. Go back to the pistol for now. Yeah, alright. Can I go in here? an hour let's actually i'm going to end the episode here uh, before we explore this so thank you guys all so much for watching part one i know we didn't do anything story related and we're just exploring the map right now um but it, it'll happen where we'll all actually progress into the story and stuff i just want to explore the map first get as much loot and stuff out of it first and then just do the story after um that's that's how like i played like borderlands and skyrim for that I, I normally just go for the most part, I go explore, and then I'll go and do the story missions because, you know, it makes it doesn't make sense to do only story and then, I mean, realistically, story-wise, it does, but, like, I like doing it reverse. I like doing things a lot weirder. So, anyways, thank you guys all so much for watching. I will see you guys soon. I'm going to go uh, eat some breakfast and drink some coffee and read, Let's read a little bit, but I will be back. We will keep playing either this or something else depending on whatever tickles my fancy at the, at the moment. So, again, thank you guys. I'm going to save it, actually, just to make sure. Yeah. Um, so, thank you, and I will see you guys later. Bye-bye now.